welcome back. As you can tell, I have a Target haul for y'all. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm going to jump right into it. It's just a few items. I'm going to call it a Target mini haul because I did go to the Target near my work and they did have a couple of the planner type supplies that everybody's been hauling. So, I figured I'd show you guys what I got. Let me just get this bag out of the way. So first up is this planner accessory kit and it was $3 and the set includes um, 25 each on the page flags, 30 each on the sticky notes. 60 sheets on the list pad and 58 stickers. I like that these were pastel stickers and um, Yeah, so let me just zoom you in just a little bit here. There we go So you have some page flags and there's cream light pink a minty green and then this neutral taupey brown and then you have arrows and some dots so I figure come spring Easter when all the pastel stuff is is ready to be used that that'll be really nice Here is the list pad. It is already pre punched for a small three ring binder, and I think honestly I'm gonna go back and get one of the small three ring binders and one of the they actually sell Planner kits like the little calendar with the dividers and everything like inserts and this kind of would fit in there with it. And I think I'm going to use that for um, like planning my YouTube videos and everything because it's getting to be a bit much for the um, Erin Condren. So uh, this one is pre-punched and it is perforated so you could, you know, tear these off here and it opens to the side. So there's that. And then there's a little close-up of the page flags. They're in that same color combination of the gray taupey brown, the cream pink and green, and then the larger pink and green. And this set is $3. So I mean, typically you'd pay a dollar for this, a dollar for this, and a dollar for the stickers in the dollar spot, so, or the bullseye's playground. So it's, you know, I'm yet to see uh, how these sticky flags are compared to the other ones that you buy. Let's see. Let's just do a test, shall we? Oh, these come up this way. Nope. They're traditional Target page flags, so they, the stickiness is very, very, very low tack. And there is a little bit of residue on the sticky note underneath. But all in all, I mean, I think I'm gonna make a dashboard and use these because I am using a lot of sticky notes in pre-planning. Let's see. Here is the list pad, and I hope that gives you the perforation a little bit better. You can see it there a little better, there you go. So you could just rip it off there um, so that you don't have to take this out to rip it out of the three ring binder. And then <clears throat> the sticker sheet. The only thing is, is that in this little set, the sticker sheet is in the back. So like it, I think it should have probably been, I mean, they did it based on size, but you know. These are glossy stickers. Yep, and they peel beautifully. And this is also punched as well. Let me get rid of these little paper circles. So I will flatten that little sticker sheet out. And um, I don't know if you saw that peel. Let me get a little closer here. So yeah, there you go. Feels really nice. These are glossy, so um, yeah. I mean, I don't think it was a bad deal, but you know, it's it's a pretty typical 
dollar bullseye's playground purchase and then this was the only other thing that i got in the bullseye playground which are these paper heart stickers and they are obviously for valentine's day don't know if they're gonna be too yeah they're like card stock esque so there's a red here a craft and then this really light pink and a white so traditional valentine's day colors they were a dollar um i don't know if i'll use them in my planner or somewhere else but they are made out of paper they're cardstock thickness i'm trying to get them back in here so i can keep them in their little housing so I don't destroy them. Which in there. There we go. And that was the last thing I got in the Bullseye's Playground. But over in the um, like school accessory aisle, they had these Valentine stickers. And you guys know I was a little bit gutted because I could only find three of the dirty sticker books. So I was happy to see this. It was a little bit more it was two dollars um there's 204 stickers in here and i just thought they were really cute um valentine stickers so you have you and me a kitty cat burger donuts um so there's lots of like ice cream those little ice creams have kawaii faces and there's a little heart with rainbow made out of the rainbow and then the little clouds are raining hearts so you could use, I mean, the donuts and the ice creams and these little popsicles and things like that, you could use anytime, especially if you're doing a donut spread. I mean, those are some nice donut stickers. And then we have like a robot space theme. Um, so you have, again, some food icons, hearts, um, stars. And this has like speckles in the background what's really cool is up here this is still sticker paper so you could technically punch that with like a round punch and get little dots that had the flat, flat background with the sprinkles and then it just repeats it's two pages that just repeat three times so not terrible compared to a Doris, it's you know it is what it is we'll see how the quality. I know sometimes my dirty sticker books, I have a heck of a time peeling. Um, these seem to be cut a little bit better. Yeah. So, we'll see. I thought they were cute. So there's those. If all else fails, we'll use them with uh, the kids' valentines to seal them up. Alright, so here was my big purchase. And I'm sure people have seen this and they probably questioned it but I had to. What this is, it is 60 tapes. So there are 60 individual rolls of these tape. So they look like washi tape. I paid $9.99 for the entire set. It is called, it's from Fashion Angels and it's called Tape Fetty. And um, See if I can get this open so I can get the glare off of it. There we go. Woo! Maybe I should have done that before I was filming. <clears throat> but here we go. So there are 60 in here. Like I said, there are nine feet. There's nine foot per roll. So it's not washi tape rolls. And these are not washi tape they're pattern tapes so as you can see there's probably enough to do one spread on these and this one is a little skull and crossbones and like a zebra tiger pattern i think And a 
as far as how these look, and I have my fingernails on, so this is not wanting to work very good. Come here. There we go. Okay, so these start out with just sticky and then there's paper backing. So there's that one. They're like a thin kind of plastic. Um, kind of like normal scotch tape, but yes. So hold this up here a little bit closer. So then we have this like Americana with the sparrows, like the old tattoo, the swirly, um, like hot pink, stripes, black and white poppies, hearts, skulls, some geometric pattern, whales, light bulbs, dots, kind of like Lisa Frank-esque um, cheetah print. 1970s and then this here is like a raspberry color this is a houndstooth on multicolor and it's ombre so it goes from color to color this is a bunch of cities New York Las Vegas Los Angeles Paris um, this pattern this geometric pattern these purple flowers the city skyline daisies um, hearts, like a teal and or turquoise and brown, like giraffe pattern, flowers, stripes, more stripes. Um, this one looks like it was off cut, but it's flowers, tape cassettes. Like, what kid really these days knows what that is? Um, sorry for all the wiggling. And then you have this like retro square. Um, this kind of looks like circuits, hexagons, more flowers, nesting dolls, like blam, woof, wah, all kinds of like <laughs> comic book sayings, um, some black floral band-aids, red poppies, green with pink, um, pixelated hearts, rainbows, lace, I don't know what you would call that one, maybe another kind of like it's an animal grant, but other than that, I don't really know. Some flags, dots and triangles, peace signs, zebra moustaches, as my son says. He calls them moustaches. Moustache. Uh, this geometric flowers, donuts, feathers, like a swirly pattern, some purple cheetah, some bunting, crowns, and microphones. This, I have no idea, like toys maybe? Oh no, it's it's food. It's eggs and bacon and strawberries and... <laughs> okay, piano keys, triangles, ice cream, some striped, and then some paint splatters. So yeah, that was $9.99. So, in the grand scheme, a roll of scotch washi is anywhere from $2.99 to $3.99. Roll from the Dollar Tree, which honestly, if I saw these at the Dollar Tree, I would buy them. So I attribute that to a comparable. They have less tape than the Dollar Tree tape, but realistically, it's going to add a pop of color and things to your spreads, which I really enjoy like I don't have donut washi and if I'm doing one spread for a donut week why would I go buy an entire roll I mean what are you gonna do 50 donut spreads in a year <laughs> you know so this one's I mean there, there's a lot of really cute ones in here so I'm hoping to get some use out of this and like I said there's probably enough one here to do one spread per roll and maybe have a little bit extra maybe to do you know up in the boxes or create little flags with so I really 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 enjoyed this for $9.99 I felt like I was getting like you know $60 worth of washi for 10 bucks like I said this is more of like a plasticky glossy type tape um, 
some of you may not like that and that's fine I just wanted to be able to add pops of other things um, to a spread so that's what I got at Target I'll just lay it all out here for you guys so I got the tape the sticker book the stickers and then the three set planner set of stickers, notepad, and posties. Alrighty guys, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. It just lets me know that you like seeing hauls. And if you're not a member of the crew yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and we can have all kinds of fun together. And always check in my description bar for any um, pertinent links to Etsy shops that I love and to Stella's shop with an exclusive coupon code. Alrighty guys, hope you have a good one and I will talk to you soon. Bye!